welcome back to the channel y'all we're in my van again and we're gonna be going camping tonight with a couple of my good friends we're gonna be camping at one of my favorite state parks here in arkansas we got some campsites right next to each other by the lake and we're gonna be cooking pizzas tonight i got the dutch oven there ready to try to cook my first pizza in it so it's gonna be a fun episode i'm really excited so let's head that way all right we're here this is cool this is a brand new visitor center they just finished this i think last year Oh, that's a hot fire. Yeah. Okay, let's go to the campsite and check it out. I'm excited to see their rig. She's got a new camper. They're gonna be like camping in a real camper with like heat and all the amenities. Oh my gosh, y'all, this campsite is sick. Look at that, right next to the lake. So that's my friends right there. I can open my side doors. Here's my view. Not too shabby. The campsite also comes with a grill, a fire pit, place to hang your food, picnic table. It looks a little slopey, but inside of the van, it feels perfectly level. So that's a good spot. While I'm waiting for Nell and Keely to get back from their hike, I'm going to start on the pizza that I'm going to cook in my Dutch oven. So we're making everything from scratch today. I'm going to start out making the pizza dough. I am using Kelly and Cody's recipe from Gourmet in the Forest, their cookbook. So let me get all my ingredients out. We need Himalayan sea salt, a package of yeast, flour, some honey, some oil which is like that so we also need some warm water so i'm going to take the stove out okay the reason i'm starting on this pizza dough is because i have to let it rise for an hour i'll probably let it hang out and do its thing they should be coming in soon. We can hang out and then by the time that I'm ready to cook, my dough should be ready. Right now, I'm just going to warm up some water really quickly. I need one cup of warm water and I did not bring a measuring cup. We'll just eyeball it. In a bowl, two cups of flour, three fourths teaspoon of Himalayan sea salt, and we're going to also add the yeast. And this is fast rising yeast, so I don't know if it's actually going to take an hour to rise. I don't really do bread, I have never really done a bread. We'll see what happens. So the yeast is in there, a tablespoon of oil. Okay, that water is warm. So I'm gonna let that cool down for a second because that's like, that water is hot. One tablespoon of honey. The water's warm, so I'm pouring it in. Get something to start with. Stirring it. Add more. I hope I have enough flour, y'all. Oh, Nails calling me. Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, kind of. You're like really breaking up. Just got service. You still on the Seven Hollows trail? Uh, we're in the parking lot at the Seven Hollows. 
All right, so my friends are three miles out. Pour oil in the bowl around the dough and cover. Let it sit and rise for one hour. There's my dough. This is Kona. Where's Keely? She's Camper. Oh, Keely! <laughs> hey! This is Nail. What's up? And this is Keely. Well, they're both Nail, technically. <laughs> but but this... I'm Nail. <laughs> exactly. They have a YouTube channel. Check us out. Nails on Trails. We're the king and queen of the day hikes. So. Yes. <laughs> we like to do West Coast trips. We're both teachers, and uh, we just do big road trips over the summer. Yeah. Two months straight, so... We're planning on uh, getting back on the YouTube channel this summer. And you guys vlogged your first adventure in the teardrop camper. Yeah. Uh -huh. now, now we've does. updated a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll give you guys a tour of their camper. All right. Here is the tour of the Nails' camper. This is the living area. Well. The eating area. Got this nice island here. Lots of storage. Is this the air conditioner? Yeah. A big fridge, the oven and the stove, which was something that Keely really wanted. I need to make my bread. Look at this pantry with the light. I love the light. TV and the fireplace. That is just so nice. Got the couch that pulls out to a bed, double recliners. Here's our bathroom. <laughs> and we got the bathroom. It's a big bathroom. Nice shower with the overhead. And then we got the bedroom. Oh, it's cool back here. Yeah. It feels nice. We need to turn on our furnace. What kind of uh, camper is this? It's an Envision, a Gulfstream Envision 290 RL. So oh, okay. We got to use, it's a 2022? I think it's a 2022 or 2021. I don't yeah. know. Okay. Like this is This is fancy stuff. <laughs> Neil and Keely just got back from their hike. They did 12 miles today. Their camper's so warm. Keely's also gonna make a pizza in her rig. She's been doing sourdough starter. I gotta get the fire going so I can get the coals hot to cook my pizza in the Dutch oven. Yeah, and get some flour and I was gonna get some stuff or some s'more. Oh, okay. I am back in my van and I'm going to make the pizza sauce for my pizza and then we'll finish up cooking over at Nail and Keeley's rig. I'm just gonna fire up this camp stove to make the sauce. One tablespoon of oil. I need to add in the shred pepper. There you go. Add the tomato sauce. Lower this heat. We're gonna add tomato paste. A little bit of sugar. Cook it for like five to ten minutes so it'll thicken up. So I can see. That's good. We're gonna let that thicken. And then I'm gonna take my sauce over to Nail and Keely's camper. So hopefully we will have some coals going in uh, our fire. There's the beginning of Keely's dough. Already have one in the oven. Oh good and look keely's pizza came out she made a chicken bacon ranch pizza oh my gosh oh, okay. looks so good. so good and nails watching the ou game we're up <laughs> <laughs> wait yeah can we try this yeah. <laughs> okay lance what piece do you want uh i'll do this one all cheers, right. cheers. <laughs> <laughs> all right that's that's good mm -hmm. pretty good mm -hmm. 
too much fire. Yeah, Sour dough crust is really good, Keely. Yeah, I do I have, have ranch, too. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Like, they film stuff back in. Dang, that, that grew. Do you have enough flour out? I don't know. Do you think I need more? I have a little bit more. Though. Yeah. Well, we'll pull this out. Here's my dough. So I'm going to just, I guess, now make it into a pizza. I don't know how big I need to make it. Put it in there. I don't think I have one. I got my pizza crust in the Dutch oven successfully. So now I'm gonna cook this over the coals for like 10 minutes and then we'll add the toppings. Yeah, I hope it works. <laughs> I found a shovel in my van, so that's perfect. Oh. We got some good coals down here. Help! <laughs> what time is it? 6.03, so in 10 minutes, we gotta check it. Got it cooking in there. Hopefully it does something. <laughs> All right, y'all. It's time to check the pizza. Trust. Where's your glove? Oh, you have gloves? No, you have a glove. I thought it's in the van. <laughs> 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 Hi, it's not done at all. <laughs> It needs more. It needs more time. To get more coals. Everything's going wrong, y'all. Like, we just don't have coals. Get in there. Get hot. Do something. All right. The pizza crust, I think, is somewhat done. So I'm going to put the toppings on it now. Now that the, the sauce is kind of cold. And then we'll do... Our freshly shredded mozzarella. Okay, it, it looks like a pizza. <laughs> uh, the, the pepperoni. That looks good to me. We don't have no more coals. That's a problem. Yeah, this could be an issue. <laughs> Just put that there. First time doing this. To emphasize that. Leave your tips in the comments. How can we make this campfire pizza better? We needed a better fire, like a, to have the fire going for yeah. longer with like more wood and, all right. Well, we're gonna give that a go. Ooh, how many minutes left? Three. Let's go. I want to watch this game, but this pizza's been occupying my entire uh, life. Uh, one by one. All right, we're gonna try. We're gonna try and see if this, this darn pizza's ready. <laughs> Ooh, I think that's good. Well, I'm not bringing this inside because it's, it's dirty on the bottom. So. Right by all the s'more stuff. Yeah. Okay, there's the pizza. Looks pretty good. It's going to be um, definitely a medium rare pizza. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Okay, so this is what the pizza turned out to be. It definitely did not come out the way I intended it to. Cause I did not have enough coals like to get the fire hot enough, but let's try it. It's good. Like this would be so good if I could just get it hot enough to cook for like, I don't know, 10 more minutes. The dough tastes good. All the flavors taste really good. We didn't wait long enough for the fire to get hot enough to like, have enough coals to put on top and on bottom of the Dutch oven. I learned a lot. <laughs> At least Keely's pizza was good. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do with the rest of that, but I'm gonna make some s'mores now. We're about over it. It's time to play games inside. <laughs> We're gonna have game night. And then they'll kick me out later in my cold, dark <laughs> van. If she's cold, it's her fault. We invited her <laughs> they, to stay. <laughs> they did invite me to stay Kelly's on the couch. Kelly's never played any of these games before. No, I haven't. So they're gonna try to teach me. I think it's Ticket Drive's the move, but I bet Keely's gonna say five crowns. I, I don't really know. love five crowns, so probably. We'll see. We can play both. It's only 8.30. <laughs> True. <laughs> These are cool. So once you have, you'll lay out five of your yellow trains to cover it. Or, since that is an event. They're teaching me how to play. It's gonna be so much fun. <laughs> we have a play. Four. Plus. And Keely won. She 
gathering the last of my heat. Good news, Nail and Keely had a heater and an extension cord. They are gonna let me borrow because it is so cold. And I have like an RV hookup site tonight. So I'm gonna plug this in and feed it through like my window or something. Yes, this is gonna be a game changer. Let's go. All right, here's home for the night. I'm actually warm. Thank you, Nail and Keely, for this heater. This is gonna be awesome. Good morning, y'all. I slept so good and so warm with that little heater. Oh my gosh, it was it was 66 degrees in here when I woke up. I'm gonna get ready because there is a little coffee shop and breakfast place right down the road here on Pettyjean Mountain, and I've never been before. So that's what we are going to do for breakfast. And it looks like it's a really nice day out, so we may actually do a hike as well. So let's go. All right, y'all, we're gearing up to go on one of my favorite hikes here in the state park. It's a really great short little hike down to a beautiful waterfall and the water should be rolling because it did rain a couple days ago. So let's go. We're at Mather Lodge. This is inside of the lodge. Back there is the restaurant. Look how beautiful this is. Cedar Falls Trail. The Cedar Falls Trail is two miles round trip. You go downhill to the waterfall, but then you gotta come back up. So it is a little bit challenging in that sense, but it's very beautiful. And I would say pretty much all levels could do that trail. So let's go. is 16 so she gets to ride down the mountain <laughs> <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed our weekend together. We had a lot of fun. Yes. Together. So much fun. Make sure you guys go subscribe to Nails on Trails YouTube channel. 
and follow along with their adventures in their rigs. We'll be on the road for about 72 days, summer 2024, so. Heck yeah. <laughs> well, thanks for having me. Yes. Yes. It was so much fun. It's always right. the best time, Kelly. Yep, for sure. All right. See ya. Bye, guys. See y'all later.